Yo, hey, what's up guys? How's it going? This is Keith Go. Welcome back to another video. It's good to have you here. You know, you're watching me, I'm watching you. We're looking at each other, we're having a conversation, but I'm the one doing the talking and you're the one doing the listening. So, thank you for listening to me. I appreciate it. Today's video, we're going to be talking about my favorite Pokemon of Generation 2. So, as I was looking through the list of Generation 2 Pokemon, you know, it was pretty easy to choose my favorite Pokemon. The only one I had trouble with was the last one, the number 5 spot, but don't worry, I got it. So, number 5 we got Houndoom. Personally, I really like the dog looking Pokemon like Arcanine and Houndoom. So that's mainly the reason I chose Houndoom as number five. The only thing I don't like about Houndoom is like when you play the games, you don't really get him until like much later in the game. So you can't really use him as much. But I think he has like a really cool design and having that dual dark and fire type is really awesome. Like just overall, I think it's a cool looking Pokemon. And I think it would be a really good Pokemon to have on the team, on your team, but early on in the games. It's kind of disappointing that you don't get him until like pretty much when you're finished with the game. And also, from what I remember about Houndoom, it's, he's kind of hard to train up, like train up in levels. But I mean, yeah, that's my number five spot. Now for the number four spot, we got Don Fan. Now the main reason I picked Don Fan as number four is because he was pretty much the first generation two Pokemon I got introduced to. I mean, Togepi was actually technically the first one, but Togepi was like seen throughout the anime of the first generation. So I didn't really count Togepi, but you know, I remember when the first Pokemon movie was released in the theaters? Yo, I went there with my cousins, my brother, man. We watched the movie, and then you see Don Fan come out in the first scene, and then you see him rolling around, you know, going against Ash. Dude, that scene was awesome. And just seeing Don Fan rolling around, man, I'm like, dude, like, who is this guy? I don't remember seeing this guy in the Pokemon games or in the anime. Like, this guy looks really awesome. So, he was my introduction to Generation 2, and when I first saw him, you know, it was like during those good times, man, when we were kids with your friends, you know, everybody was into Pokemon watching the first movie. You know, those are good memories I can't forget. So Don Fan, number four. All right, number three spot, got Hitmontop. Now Hitmontop is my favorite evolution of like the three Hitmons. You know, Hitmonchan, Hitmonlee, and Hitmontop. Like during the first generation, I didn't really like Hitmonlee or Hitmonchan, you know, they didn't really appeal to me. But then Hitmontop got introduced and yo, you know, you see him like pretty much on his head, you know, spinning like, that's cool. You know, like what other Pokemon does that? Like, you know, it's really cool. And I think the first time I used Hitmontop was in Pokemon Coliseum and he, he instantly became like one of my go-to Pokemon to use in battle. So it was really fun using him and just seeing him like spinning around in his design. Dude, everything about him on top is cool and it just became like one of my favorite Pokemon, one of my favorite fighting type Pokemon. So him on top, definitely number three. All right, now we'll come up to the number two spot and the number two spot is one of the evolutions, Umbreon. So during the first generation, Jotian was originally my favorite evolution, but then Umbreon got introduced and dude, just seeing like how slick and cool he looks you know he just looks like mysterious i like how like the rings around him like they glow and just just his overall design dude i, I like it like it's definitely my number one favorite evolution of all time even if you compare him to like the other ones like sylveon and Ephion, i still choose umbreon as my number one evolution i mean check this out man check this out you know at the Pokemon Center when they were selling like Eevees like with all his costumes you know you have Vaporeon, Jolteon, Glaceon, Lithion. of course I had to buy the Umbreon one dude just because I like it dude it's black yellow dude it's definitely my favorite like I don't know I don't know what else to say about it in Pokemon Go I powered him up to max even though his, his power isn't that strong and what do I know about Umbreon his defenses are high but his, his attack isn't as strong so I mean I still think he's cool and yeah that's my number two spot so my number one spot I had no trouble picking my number one and and my number one favorite Pokemon is Chikorita. Now, Chikorita is actually my favorite Pokemon of all time. Out of all the Pokemon, Chikorita is my number one, number one favorite. You guys are probably asking, like, why Chikorita? So, when I was a kid, you know, you got Pokemon Red and Blue got released, everybody got into it, we were all happy. And then Generation 2 got released, and again, everybody got excited, like, yo, Generation 2 of Pokemon? Let's do this. So, as we were playing, like, you know, I bought Silver Version, and my friends, you know, bought Gold Version, Silver Version, or whatever. And everybody chose Totodile and Cyndaquil. It was always Totodile and Cyndaquil. No one ever chose Chikorita. I was like around eight years old when the games got released. So uh, eight-year-old me thought back to like when I was six years old, five years old, like in kindergarten. And during kindergarten at the playground, like when we got divided into teams and we had like team leaders, no one ever chose me to be part of their team. I was always the last one to get picked. And also during like other times during recess, no one ever wanted to play with me. They like preferred to play with other people. Next thing you know, you know, 
fast forward a couple years later, I'm eight years old, nine years old, people are picking Toto down in Santa Quinn, and then no one's picking Chikorita, and I'm like, yo, Chikorita, I understand you, man. Like, no one ever picked me, no one ever wanted to be my friend, no one wanted to play with me, so I have a really soft spot for you. So I picked Chikorita as, you know, my starter Pokemon for Silver Version. And I don't know, I just kind of like, man, me and Chikorita are meant to be together, like, we're both owners. <laughs> I mean, I'm kind of exaggerating, but I'm actually being honest here. And to prove that Chikorita was my favorite Pokemon, um, I bought this Nintendo magazine that kind of showed like a guide to Pokemon Silver and Gold. And in the guide, I still have that book to this day, but I don't know where it's at. In the guide, um, it showed like all Generation 2 of Pokemon, and I circled Chikorita two times, and I'm like, the best Pokemon ever. So I still have that book somewhere, and even now, it's still my favorite Pokemon, man. You know, it's just so cute. I really like the design, and... I think it's gonna remain my number one spot because like I said, I always liked it as a kid. I still like it now. Good time, man. Good memories. So anyway, that's my number one spot. Not really an exciting list because I don't really have any legendaries and like I don't have any of the cool ones like Sneasel or like, Tyranitar. But that's my list and you know those are my favorite Pokemon. And what is your guys' favorite generation two Pokemon? You know, generation two was awesome. It was like I think it's one of my favorite generations. And yeah, um, drop a comment, let me know what your favorite Gen 2 Pokemon is and you know, I look forward to reading it. And yeah, uh, thank you for watching this video and I'll see you guys in the next video, alright? Peace out.